Welcome to the Hallie Elise Show, featuring your host, empowerment psychic, Hallie Elise. She is an author, psychic, and media personality, and has been listed as one of the top 100 psychics in America. Empowerment psychic Hallie Elise shares the spiritual, metaphysical, holistic, and magical powers of the universe. Follow Hallie on her website at HallieElise.com, and all her shows can be seen via live stream video. Now, here's your host, Empowerment Psychic, Hallie Elise. She has like a terrible... Hi, how are you this evening? And welcome to the Hallie Elise Show. I'm delighted this evening, as I always am, when I have a guest to introduce Stephanie from How. And How is actually H-O-W with a question mark. And if you're thinking, oh, that's odd, how does that work? Well, How is holistic organic wellness? And the reason for the question mark is to find out how you get there. So without any sort of ado, here's Stephanie. Hi, honey. Hi. How are you? <laughs> I'm great. Thank you so much for having me. I'm glad that you could join us this evening. I see our producers coming in to play with cameras, which is a good thing. <laughs> Don't get carried away there, you. Thank you. Beautiful. Perfect. <laughs> Anyways, so we're supposed to have both of you this evening. We're supposed to have you and your cohort in crime over at House. And Adriana, sadly, isn't here this evening. So no, I'm solo flying tonight, but that's okay. I guess we will talk about essential oils and fragrances and that type of thing, whereas if she were joining us, we'd also talk about nutrition. Yes, that would be both. Okay. Correct. So... What about oils? I don't know if anybody can see this. I'm sure they all can. This funky little thing here. Is this one that uh, changes colors? Yes, it's changing colors. Okay. It's going from green to blue to purple. This is a nebulizing cold water diffuser. And okay. so our store is called Holistic Organic Wellness. Right. And what we do at Holistic Organic Wellness is show people how. How to work with essential oils, how to detoxify, how to beautify, exactly. how to pamper and purify in gentle ways that... Um, produce really beautiful shifts when you do these little tiny subtle shifts and so one of those little tiny subtle things you can do is this <laughs> and this is diffusing some essential oils into the air and so this is my first time on air anywhere so I was a little <laughs> nervous so I brought I my diffuser be able to breathe and relax it's like my and, comfort blanket and you know it works out really well because there's men that are in here before our show <laughs> Need I say more? You know, uh, girl, <laughs> girls want to come in and smell that soft, sweet aroma, right? Yes, and we're <laughs> we're getting it. the nice scent, and we're also getting therapeutic benefits. So that's what's right. really the kicker. What's so spectacular about it is that we can enjoy it. It smells nice. It's enjoyable. But we're also oxygenating our brains, Absolutely. and that increases our sense of well-being. We feel good when there's oxygen getting to our brain. Right now, <clears throat> I don't know if anybody can see because um, the lighting is a little askew, but. It's actually lavender in this moment, and it changes from lavender to blue to uh, actually starting to change as we speak, <laughs> um, to pink, to green, and it not only adds to the environment as far as something aesthetic to look at, but colors themselves also generate a vibration. I've spoken about that many times on the show, where there's a specific frequency that's emitted from color. So you're getting, if you will, a double whammy in a positive sense yes. when you're using <clears throat> the essential oils and you have this fragrance moving into the air as well as the color vibration in your space and you also have the opportunity to choose a color so if you want to resonate say with this indigo right here right which and we're diffusing frankincense which is kind of to connect spiritually Absolutely. and to open our crown and uh, connect with spirit right um, so stopping it on that indigo color and maybe taking some deep breaths while staring into it is going to kind of bring you to that frequency and the same thing with the green. Green has to do with health and it has to do with wellness. And even if you are doing a meditation that's focusing on money, you know, finance is getting better. Using the green is very positive. We're actually doing a workshop this upcoming Wednesday, September 16th okay. with Sheree Shanti, and we're doing Drumming Dollars and Dreams. Ooh, I like and the name, Drumming yeah. Dollars and Dreams. We're That's gonna pretty awesome. We're going to have a great abundance ritual, and we're going to drum, and we're going to okay. use essential oils and colors. So like since you're mentioning this, let's give out the phone number for the shop so that if somebody wants to come join you, they can. Yes, so we have our workshops, our how-to workshops, every Wednesday night at the House Center, and our phone number is 561-955-0099. Again, that's 561-955-0099. See, she's a natural. You would have thought she's on the air all the time. <laughs> 
Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so since you mentioned that you do programs and workshops and every Wednesday there's something different going on. I know I did meditation classes, for instance, over at How, and um, Carolina, a friend of ours, did things with gongs, and you've done the oils, and Tina did a little special thing. So that there's a whole bunch of people we know in the community that end up over at How. Um, even Dr. Love was over there recently. So the point that I'm trying to make is it is a great place to connect with like-minded people, but also professionals that can share their wisdom. And so if, let's say, somebody is facilitating a particular topic and they feel it would be in alignment with what you do, how do they go about getting involved with you? Do they just stop in? Do they call? What's the best route? We love to work with the community and to work with other small businesses to promote each other because right. we want it to be a win-win on all ends. So we love to support others and have them support us. Absolutely. And one way we do that is do custom essential oils for events. So we did um, Melissa Binkley's Pure Body Love and we set up our aromatherapy workshop and everybody could come and make a salt soak. Mm. We're actually doing that this weekend at the... Uh, Waldorf. I remember at the Emerge Retreat. That. Yes. That's Kelly Keisha's event. Kelly Keisha, yeah. She sent me a note saying, Are you going to stop by? <laughs> I said, oh, Let me see like, the schedule. I'm actually going to run in maybe for a few hours. Uh, well, you have on to make a days. bath soak. Okay. And so we have four <laughs> choices to choose from. She wants it to be all about freedom. So sure. I custom blended some essential oils for financial freedom, Wonderful. for emotional freedom, for free to be me, um, to be really connected to yourself right really live your life's purpose that and type of time thing. freedom so uh you can come and make a blend and it's free of charge and nice. we talk about intention and adding the essential oils to the salts and we kind of say an affirmation and hold and shake the oils right. to um, blend them into the salt and that activity um is healing in itself and so then you have Absolutely. Every oil I pour, I pour in prayer and in meditation mm -hmm. and with intention that each specific chemical constituent is going to go to the right person, to the right part of their body, and be the received. The property's going to blend properly, exactly. They're going to receive the healing they're ready to receive and let go of what no longer serves them. And right. we think that intention is carried on when it's poured into it the bottle. It absolutely is. And the fact that, you know, when somebody is holding it and they're shaking it, um, actually, if you look at some of the sacred texts from Egypt and uh, Mesopotamian uh, we'll say other places in that region from many many years ago they did a lot of custom blending you know they would actually go out and they would gather flowers and herbs and would use rocks and use their dishes and use the sunshine and things of the earth so that they could extract those oils and, and those scents and then they would use them in prayer and the intention is huge because you're taking that energy and moving it through you into that oil so the person that's getting that is not only taking home what the intention is from you but it's magnified yes it's like when you um pray in a group or when you meditate in a group you have that massive energy that comes together so anything that you can get from stephanie you know that it's already has a catalyst to make things happen in your life so Thank that's you wonderful. That. And, you know, speaking of the essential oils and the fact that they're healing and all, I want to definitely make sure that people know about your facials. I actually brought you up and uh, Adriana, I think it was last week and the week before. I've mentioned you a couple of Thank times. Thank you so much. <laughs> she does the most amazing facials, truly the most amazing facials. And you could say, oh, well, a lot of people use nice creams. They use nice things. But this is different. This is not just a session for relaxing. This is not just a session for your skin to be improved or for your skin to glow it is an experience because when you go in you smell all the different scents that you're surrounded by of course the room is lit beautifully and soft and um, Stephanie has the ability to know if you like uh, we'll see deeper pressure or lighter pressure on your skin and of course she'll check with you but she goes into this automatic flow and there's never that break in that flow meaning a lot of times you go to places and somebody will work on you and then they stop and they're futzing around and they're making noises in the background and it's very disturbing and jarring when you're supposed to be relaxing that doesn't happen over to how so if you want like a facial like you've never gotten before Call Stephanie. <laughs> Thank you very much. I think that comes true, from though. being a second generation aromatherapist and esthetician. So right. having been raised with a mother who was passionate about plant-based skin care and holistic healing modalities, um, it's an honor and a privilege for me to carry on her legacy doing uh, facials and skin care and right. um, treating the whole person because, you know, when you're you're massaging the face with essential oils. We're using them for the same purposes they were using them in Absolutely. Egypt. Uh, it is a spiritual ritual. It is a physical, emotional, 
uh, beauty. And you can have emotional releases while yes. you are laying on the table. And it's not that all of a sudden somebody falls apart, but oftentimes something that's been troubling them or something that's just kind of falls been off. kind of sitting there just doesn't seem to bother them anymore. And that's amazing. It's beautiful. It that is. That can happen with, so gently. And that's kind of our whole concept is right. that it should happen gently. When we talk about detoxify, beautify. We're not talking about detoxify like a 10-day juice cleanse. Right. We're talking about detoxification of... Um, synthetic fragrance which is known hormone disruptors exactly. detoxifying letting go of your cell phone we don't really ask that you you know check in well i'll let you know she has hers on the table there <laughs> only to tell you about our dates and events because i can't keep it all up here <laughs> i know we don't know nobody uses a notepad anymore it's all on the phone it's like i did the same thing i was taking notes on something yesterday i'm like oh wait a minute where's the phone and i typed it all in whereas you know in the past you would have written an actual note or well, had then you a have notebook. to remember to check your phone for the notes that's true too and that's Can't when you have you to use that. peppermint and rosemary <laughs> oil when you're taking notes because then you'll remember 33 percent better that's it and we were talking about rosemary yesterday i believe also as far as was i having the conversation with you i think no, you know what? It well, was we can talk about rosemary. No, you know what? I had to think about that for a moment. There's a, a gal that I know that does aromatherapy and works also with um, the same grade essential oils that you do. And she was talking about, um, if you will, emotional connections with rosemary. And I was saying to her that you can actually anoint your doorways with mm -hmm. rosemary for protection. And that when you are feeling stressed or overwhelmed, just actually move the rosemary under your nose. It's wet, wet it under your clear. nose, you clear immediately. That's an incredibly clearing oil, and I, I've taken mediumship classes, and we started every mediumship class with rosemary oil. Mm -hmm. And of all the oils you can choose, I tend to use frankincense when I want to connect. I love connect. frankincense. But this specific teacher felt very called to rosemary mm -hmm. as the clearing oil, and I, I really feel that nice uh, shift when I smell it. And what's interesting and so cool about oils is where we scent, where we process scent, right. is where we store emotion. Exactly. Uh, so everybody has a different response to an oil. And so we're actually having a class, not this week, but the next. It's September 9th, I believe. Okay. And we're doing a joyful writing with aromas. Ooh. So we're going to be using oils as a catalyst for emotion. You have to remind me about that one. Our friend Kat the, Cool, she's amazing. You can check her out on YouTube by Kat Cool, C O U L. E. Okay. She's going to be coming and doing a creative, joyful writing exercise. So we'll smell an oil, and you can just kind of allow that to take you somewhere and then right. give you a prompt for joy, and we're going to journal on that. Wonderful. You know, I was thinking, too, in respect to oils, people don't realize if you have a baby who's fussy, you can use oil, and it makes a difference. we got to take a quick break, but we'll be right back with the Hallie Elise Show. Bob, did you see Hallie Elise in the paper? Who? The empowerment psychic, Hallie Elise. They did a two-page write-up. The columnist was enthralled. Hallie went right to an issue that she was dealing with. I'm looking at HallieElise.com right now. What are you thinking? Should we schedule an appointment? Matter of fact, yes. You have issues with Sue and me, my business. Take a look at her background. It's impressive, and she has decades of experience. I want to put it on my iPad. What's her info? Empowerment Psychic Hallie Elise. HallieElise.com 561-755-2166 Spell it. H-A-L-L-E-Y-E-L-I-S-E dot -E -E com So it's HallieElise.com and 561-755-2166, right? 561-755-2166, that's it. You're listening to Empowerment Psychic, Hallie Elise, and she invites you to visit her website for more information about all that she does at HallieElise.com. Now, back to your host, Empowerment Psychic, Hallie Elise. Got it? <laughs> Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the Hallie Elise Show. I'm here with Stephanie from How, that's H-O-W with a question mark. And if you're just tuning in, it is the Holistic Organic Wellness Center, which is right on Federal Highway in Boca Raton. And we were just talking about the essential oils that they have. And uh, one of the things that they do very often is have different programs and they teach and 
They love when you come in and ask questions. So know that it's not just about the essential oils. Uh, Adriana, your partner, wasn't able to join us this evening, but she knows about nutrition like uh, the back of her hand. It's amazing. You come in and you go, oh, well, you know, my tummy's been a little upset. And she, she'll say, oh, have you tried this? You know, And there, there's an herb or there's a supplement that's going to make a difference. And she's very well versed. So if you'd like to pop in, you can. Why don't you give everybody your address too so that they know the exact location. We are located just south of Spanish River in between 32nd Street and Spanish River on Federal Highway and the address is 3270 North Federal Highway in Boca Raton 33431. I don't know that they needed the zip but that's okay. <laughs> I'm just thinking too, I always use the Leather Express yes. as, um, if you will, a landmark. They are right next to the Leather Express. But then I remember that I'm giving Leather Express, you know, free kudos. So I'm going to have to talk They're to them very about nice that. There. They are, they are very pleasant, <laughs> but it's right next door. Actually, you're in a really good shopping center because 32nd uh, across the street is Denny's. So there's a million people that go there. And then directly across from your center, you know, is my favorite nail place. And I will give them a free plug, L&T Nails nicest people nicest people you ever want to deal with and they do a beautiful job and if you go in tell tim and lily hallie said hi they will be delighted but truly you want a great manicure a great pedicure that's who you should go to and they are directly across the street and then there's those little consignment shops so i mean you're in a, it's a great beautiful community area. it really it is. is and it's all very um in as much as it doesn't look artsy or cafe ish it has that feel yes and that's, that's kind of nice, you know, because you go in and everybody's very welcoming and everybody's very engaging and everybody refers to everybody, which is amazing. Yes, and we have a wonderful acupuncturist and massage therapist next door. Next door. So it really is wonderful to have so many healing modalities in the same area. Absolutely. Um, and we've been told that, you know, when you pull in, if you can't quite find us, you can smell us. Yes. So <laughs> just true. wafting down the street, you can follow your nose and, and you'll see the sage <laughs> burning and the incense and the oils coming out the door and it kind of will draw you right in and we invite you to come in and hang out in our zen room we have just Which a little is room also amazing we just ask you to hang out and breathe and um, and you have the foot baths too yes, we that also you still do for the detox which is kind of nice you're going to go in there and go oh, okay, i'm going to take 15 minutes and i'm just going to let go of anything i don't need and while i'm doing that i'm just going to relax my head's going to relax and in the space it's so easy to do so you leave like a whole new person. I mean, truly. That's the goal. That's it. Okay, so everybody knows now that your name is How, and everybody knows that you do programs, and anybody listening, that is, <laughs> knows that you have things having to do with nutrition and things having to do with essential oils and healing and teaching. But, there's a but, what's your primary objective for the shop? I would say um, to spread the message that there are many paths to the top of the mountain. Um, okay. I think that everybody, not everybody, I won't say that there's many people out there going that this is the way. Yes. It worked for me, so it will work for you. And you can feel broken if that way doesn't work for you. Absolutely. And um, I feel very fortunate to have uh, walked many different paths in my life and, and picked up tools along the way that worked for a while and then I didn't want to use anymore mm -hmm. and then I picked up another tool and I really love that and it would be tapping or Bach flower remedies or right. essential oils or meditation or breathing or power posing and these are all, for, all, all close to free mm -hmm. um, accessible tools and we want people to know that those are all available you don't need to have a lot of money there isn't just one way no. that there's many many ways and if we don't know the way I'm dedicated to finding it for you and connecting you with the right person so that you can get on a path to healing. Okay, perfect. And I think you said it very apropos that there are many paths to that top. And um, I think we're very much reminded by Dr. Wayne Dyer, who just passed. I do want to make mention that he passed on Saturday evening at the age of 75 in his sleep in his bed. And um, you know, his family was cute. They're like, well, that scurvy elephant will be happy on his new adventure. And it's true because he always looked at everything as very joyful and his approach was, look, look at this poem, look at this posture, look at this meditation, look at how your mind is working, look at how you're interacting with the world. So he too had that viewpoint of really entertaining the idea that there's just not one set way. And what I have found is that those who we construe as masters, who are very talented, very gifted, who impart a lot of wisdom, they tend to do what you did you know they'll play with a tool for a while they put that down they go on to the next tool and instead of it being that there is one tool 
they find, depending on the person they're dealing with, that perhaps a couple of tools will work. Or if this one tool in particular doesn't do the job completely, then there is that other one. So you mentioned tapping. For those who don't know what tapping is, you can take a look at YouTube. You will be amazed at something so simple that is so effective. Bach flower remedies, another thing. Um, Christopher, who you know through me. Um, Lady Christopher, you know her from one of the other shows here on WNN, and you also know her from being on my show several times. She is skilled in Bach flower remedies, and it has an amazing potency, and it's funny because it's an essence. It's a vibration, if you will, more than even the essence in water, in purified water, and it has massive effects. And talking Keep about greats that have passed, missing. we just lost Dr. Emoto, who talks yes, about yes. What the was that last year? Because yeah. um, I, I right think, after we yes. saw him at the, o I was going to say after he was here, yes, yes in Florida, right next after thing, he you know, visited he us, yes. And if the if the planet is like eighty percent water and, and our, our bodies, bodies exactly, so th we think that the the future of medicine is quantum, mm -hmm. that it is vibrational and color, light, sound. sound. Thoughts have energy, have yes. form. Words have energy, have form. And I think it's teaching people to choose uh, the, the positive words and, and the Absolutely. Uh, essential oil over the spray. Um, right. Well, chemicals, any time that you use them, always have a residual effect, whether the person is aware of it or not. It does change the frequency within a space. It can affect your sinuses. It can um, create all sorts of different types of reaction with the skin that you might not even be aware of. You know, you go to sleep and you wake up and you say, oh, I'm itchy. Why am I itchy? What well, I didn't eat anything. And you don't realize it was the air spray that you put in the room. Yes. You know, whereas an essential oil, unless you're allergic, and very few people are allergic to, we'll say, the high quality oils. Anything that's been processed properly, um, distilled in the right way right. so that the chemical constituents in the oils are um, at the proper proportions. Um, it can get dense, so I won't go super dense, but because they're so heterogeneous, they, people who have issues with scent typically don't, don't right. in the treatment room, even though I do a completely custom aromatherapy facial, right. because I know how to use the oils properly and in the right dilutions. But see, that's the key, the dilution. Yes, you it know, is. Some, and it's similar to, you ever walk by someone and you think, oh my God, they put on so much fragrance. <clears throat> And you, you can't no, breathe. That never happens. <laughs> okay, be nice. <laughs> Same thing happens in New York City, yes, just so that you know. <laughs> but all kidding aside, it's that, wow, what, what are they wearing? Like, don't they realize? You don't typically have that with essential oil if it's used in the right proportion. What's amazing it's more subtle. is that I think we spoke about patchouli. We both like yes. these very musky, yes, musky scents. earthy types of things. Yes. And um, patchouli, if you smell it in a small amount, is enlivening it it's lifts you up. it's almost an Absolutely. aphrodisiac it, it lifts you right but if you have it in a large quantity it it'll be knock very repressive. you right out right uh, so it has to do with quantity uh, they are medicine so if it takes one or five pounds of raw material to produce one pound of the essential oil mm -hmm. it's really a lot going in so it's about using it in the proper amounts and that's why we also well, exist so to you, show people how. you create sprays for people as well so uh, they don't necessarily let's say somebody comes in and goes well i like the way that smells but no i don't like oils they're too heavy you can actually use a sandalwood oil for instance that you blend other essential oils into yes. or a cream for instance mm -hmm. uh, you've got this amazing cleanser i'm like really pushing here tonight folks but the truth is love the products they're amazing Thank it's because you. they're all custom blended by stephanie and you know so there's that love that goes into it and you definitely feel it it reminds me really of uh there was a film like water from chocolate i don't know if you're familiar with it it was a foreign film but it was all about this person's emotion as she was cooking. And when she cooked a meal with love and with vibrancy, everybody ate the meal and they were like, wow, they just enjoyed it. And then when she was sad or stressed, all of a sudden everybody sat very solemn. Anyways, believe it or not, that's our time. It flies, doesn't it? One more time, give out your phone number so they can call you. It's 561-955-0099. Thanks, honey. Thank okay, you so, so much for how. having me. Remember Stephanie and meet Adriana if you go on out to see the folks at Hal. Thanks for tuning in to the Hallie Ali Show. Hope you got a little something about essential oils and uh, check us, some of them out. You'll find that you're happy that you did so. Thank you. Thank you. Be enchanted and delighted. Connect each week here on WNN for the Halle Elise Show. Also on Facebook and at HalleElise.com.
Thanks for tuning in. 